This video provides a quiz on interpretation of McConkie's bacterial growth medium. The quiz material is followed by a review of McConkie's selective and differential properties. Four different McConkie's plates will be presented. Each has been inoculated with a different unknown bacterial sample. Do 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 Okay, I'll stop. Let's review now. McConkie's is a selective bacterial growth medium. McConkie selects for, meaning that it encourages the growth of gram-negative bacteria. So if I see something growing on McConkie's, it is gram-negative. McConkie's is also differential. Gram-negative bacteria that are able to ferment the sugar lactose will grow in pink colonies on McConkie's. Gram-negative bacteria that do not ferment lactose will grow on McConkie's, but they'll grow in colorless colonies. Okay, so now let's review the quiz material. This plate does show bacterial growth that means that the unknown I placed on this plate is a gram-negative bacteria. They also appear to be a deep or bright pink color. This indicates that they are lactose-fermenting bacteria. They're able to break down the sugar lactose. This plate does not have any bacterial growth. In fact, it looks almost like a brand new sterile plate, but I know that it was inoculated with an unknown bacterial sample. Since there is no growth, that would indicate that my unknown is a gram-positive bacteria. This plate does show bacterial growth so I know that I have a gram-negative organism as my unknown number three. 
The colonies are not pink in color. This indicates that they're not lactose fermenting bacteria, that they are unable to break down the sugar lactose. Here's our last plate, plate number four, the one that was described as being a little trickier to interpret. I can start with the selective aspect that I see growth, so I know that growth is gram-negative bacteria. When I look at the color, I don't really have a bright pink bacteria. I don't really have colorless. It's in between. These are weak lactose fermenters. More seriously nerdy, amazing free stuff at scienceprofonline.com. Go there.